When you die, somebody else was born But at least we got to say we Ran on the digital, we ran on the money We ran on the digital, we ran on that money We ran on the digital, we ran on the money What's going on guys? It's Devin Prasco with the Prasco Willers And today I'm going to be doing um, a different type of video This isn't your normal like vlog, basketball type video, stuff like that I'm going to be talking about um, or giving my opinion on a basketball player, I guess. He's been coming up a lot on YouTube videos, um, stuff like that. I've been hearing about it, hearing his name a lot. And I just wanted to give my opinion on him and just, I don't know. It's just a different type of video I want to do. So let's get right into it. So today we're going to be talking about Kobe Paris, um, who um, is a player at, um, going to be a, uh, player at Cal State Northridge and um, he transferred from Creighton after his freshman year and I'm pretty sure he's gonna have to sit out this year and then he'll play his junior and senior year at Cal State Northridge or whatever and um, I I'm not a like I don't know everything about his background there is a video um, that I found online that they um, give a pretty good explanation of like his background, everything like that. So I'll leave that link in the description below if you want to um, know more about him, I guess. But he is a Philippine basketball player. He played with the Philippine um, national team. And he played his high school basketball in uh, California where he then committed to UCLA. But then he was ruled academically ineligible, so he transferred to Creighton. And his freshman year, he didn't get much playing time. And um, that made him transfer to uh, Cal State, where they're still D1, but they're obviously not at a level of Creighton or UCLA. So the question that everyone is wondering is, do um, do you think Kobe Paris will play in the NBA or have a career in, in the NBA? And uh, me personally, I think that he could. Um, coming out of high school, he was only a three-star recruit, I think. Uh, in the video that I watched, I think they're saying how ESPN only had him at like a 74 rating. And all the big recruiting websites had him at a um, three-star recruit. Um, so he wasn't that great of a player coming out of high school. So I don't think going to that big of a school really helped him much because he ain't going to get much playing time. But now that he transferred to Cal State Northridge, which is a smaller D1 school, I think he'll get to play a lot. And I think that will benefit, benefit him a lot. And then maybe he'll get drafted into like second round, late second round, something like that. But I think he might be able to find a way to make a team. Um, he's pretty athletic. He can shoot the ball. Um, I mean, he played on the Philippine national team, so he's got to be pretty decent. And um, yeah, I just I think that he if he keep if he develops and works hard and everything like that, I think going to a smaller school like Cal State is going to help him a lot. And he's definitely going to um, be able to put up numbers and catch some people's eyes and then hopefully make it to the NBA and just um, get an opportunity and um, just run with it and just do good in that role or that role he gets or opportunity he gets or whatever and just hopefully be a solid like bench player or something like that. But yeah, I think I think he can definitely have a chance at making it in the NBA. Um, I know it's kind of a short video, but uh, let me know down in the comments um, below what you think of Kobe Pars, if you know of him, if you haven't even heard of him, comment that. Um, let me know what you think, if you think he can be in the NBA, anything like that. And um, don't forget to leave a like on this video. i would be much appreciated. If you like these types of videos, um, I can definitely make more of these and then like put the players' footages, stuff like uh, footage of their game, stuff like that, instead of just pictures like I have now. But um, yeah, so let me know down below. Don't forget to leave a like. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button. And we'll see you in the next one. Peace. I just wanna rolly, rolly, rolly with a dab of ranch. I already got some designer to hold on my pants. I just want some ice on my wrist so I look better when I.